Hey, it's Cliff. Ethereum miners can once again rejoice as the Ethereum network team pushes back their difficulty bomb once again. Just a few months ago, Ethereum developers were asking users to update their nodes, the devices that run the network software and typically store the immutable ledger of transactions. They're at it again, this time to delay what's known as a difficulty bomb, a periodic task that would become obsolete after Ethereum 2.0 takes full effect and the network transitions to proof of stake consensus model that does away with crypto mining. So if you don't know what a, a difficulty bomb is, once we reach a certain block on the Ethereum network, it will become increasingly difficult to mine Ethereum, eventually to the point that we can't mine at all. At that point, they will transition from mining Ethereum on their network to proof of stake model, which will completely do away with mining and we will have to come over to what to mine and find us something new and hopefully profitable as you can see right now ethereum is still number one and even it's even holding the number two spot when you look at it on nice ash so when i look at these other coins i'm not quite familiar with what we can move to mine i i've heard good things about raven coin but really the only thing raven coin seems to be known for at least to my knowledge is an alternative to mining uh, Ethereum. So I guess once this happens, if it eventually ever does happen, we will have to figure that out. The article states, unlike the London hard fork, which changed the Ethereum fee structure and introduced deflationary pressure to the network, the Aero Glacier upgrade slated for this week is nowhere near as drastic. In fact, it isn't even as adventure-packed as Altair, the October upgrade that prepped the beacon chain, the starting point for Ethereum switch to proof of stake for its prime. Aero Glacier's sole purpose is to stop a bomb from going off and give developers more time to move the network to Ethereum 2.0. Without, without it, the current network could become less usable. So the developers are needing more time. They are pushing back their difficulty bomb because if they didn't do this, they wouldn't have the network because Ethereum is utilized by miners. They need the miners to function. <laughs> so Ethereum is, they keep pushing their move to proof of stake back. And the way I look at it, that's great for us because most of us are mining and we want to make that sweet sweet ethereum so i guess we can rejoice that once again they've they've pushed proof of stake back now it's it's not necessarily great for people that actually want to utilize the network as far as moving uh different apps or anything along the network um, nfts things of that sort because the gas fees are outrageous and it's almost to the point that you can't even use ethereum but if you're still looking to get some mining in and hopefully make a little bit of money there's still time so you know happy mining let me know what you think down below